Tonight, thanks for joining us. We begin with new information on the hit and run at the Cathedral of St. John the Evangelist Cemetery. Lafayette police have located the suspect who drove a truck through the gates of the Cathedral of St. John the Evangelist Cemetery. As we said, the driver also desecrated several graves. News 10's Britt LaFaso spoke with a trustee who questions why someone would do this just before Christmas. Authorities believe this hit and run suspect was driving down this road when, for an unknown reason, they veered off the road, drove straight through the gates of the cemetery here, drove over several graves, and then exited the cemetery, again driving back through the gates, causing even more damage. Looks like last night on the eve of Christmas Eve, somebody uh, went through this, went over the graves. The graves, some, uh, we had somebody come push the, some of the grave parts back together and then took off and came out the fence on the other side. Lafayette police say the incident happened around 2 a.m. Friday morning. Friday night, authorities located their suspect. A Lafayette man, Ronez Jermall Sanders Jr., was issued citations for driving under suspension, careless operation, and hit and run. Cemetery trustee Jean Loyal says they're now making the necessary repairs to the gates, graves, and tombstones that were destroyed. It's a terrible deal especially at this time of Christmas where God is so much faith and hope and love that we have to deal with this. But nobody got hurt that we know of and so we, uh, uh, we at Cathedral are uh, very much feel the love of everybody in Acadiana and we thank you for your support in getting back this back together. Reporting in Lafayette, Britt LaFosso, Caleb Wine, News 10.